Bob Ross could have painted that, you know. It's that pretty. Skadoosh. Guys, we're witnessing probably a once-in-a-lifetime experience right here. And I'm lucky enough to capture it all on freaking camera. This is our fourth box. Courtesy, ground zero. Not courtesy. Uh, well, yeah, courtesy. I'm just cracking it for him in the shop. This is funkin' crazy. We are hitting nothing but insanity. I I'm going to open this, and you're going to see something. That's going to make it hard to smile when you open your box. <laughs> Here we go. Crimson friggin' Val, baby. I mean, this is this is nutty, guys. All the same little, uh, you know, number down there and everything. All from the same case. Um, This is this is crazy. Okay, we've opened nothing but showcase so far, right? Showcase, three foil mythics in one box. Um, nothing but showcase foil in another box. It's just... Or showcase, just, just showcase, 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 showcase. Let's go. Let's go. As Jeremy from Unsleeved Media would say, let's go. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay. All jokes aside, you guys are in for a treat, and so am I, man. I can't wait. This is just nuts. I'll never, this will never happen again. Olivia's attendance, starting out with our first showcase. Uvenwald Oddity, rare. And the old Wanderlight Spirit. Well, oh, hot diggity darn. I'm going to make a separate pile for these rares, just for fun, okay? Just for fun. We got a, a boar token. A boar token. It's crazy, man. This is crazy. Okay. Have you guys opened anything like this? No. Okay. I'm going to say no, okay? That's a stupid question. No one's going to respond to that. Um, watch someone's like, I've opened like 24 boxes the same, Joe. It's nothing special, stupid. Uh, we got Blood Craze. And then we got the old Hyphy. Bam, Edgar Charmed Groom, like, showcase for, ha oh, ha, my gosh, guys, there's Giralf, Giralf Visionary Stitcher in the foil showcase, can't make this stuff up, guys, guys, can't make this stuff up, <laughs> cannot make it up, um, but hey, yeah, what, pro okay, here's a good one, what products have you guys been opening, <clears throat> you know what I've been opening, everything that Wizards made of this product, I've, I've been opening, <laughs> that's, that's what we're opening here on Bad Boy MDG. But what is it you guys are opening? Like, did you go out and get a bundle? Did you go out and get a couple packs, maybe? Did you get a, a collector booster box? Uh, did you get a set, uh, you know, a couple set packs? You know, whatever. Like, I want to hear about it, man. Edgar, Charmed Groom, times two, with a foil, Hal Pack Piper. This is... <sighs> what are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing here? Comes into play, return all blue creatures your opponent's control to understand your opponents can't play blue creatures. Oh, that's freaking brutal, dude. That is freaking brutal. Okay. That's <laughs> brutal. Hey, like, that just shuts the game down <laughs> for your opponent. Throw any blue, you know. Almost locks them out completely. Uh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Well, creature wise, anyway. Here we go. Another. No, oh, no. Doom Weaver. Doom Weaver shows up. This is insanity, guys. I don't think you're ready for all this. Katilda. Katilda. Nope, not a showcase. That is uh, one of our first commander cards. That's a showcase. What am I saying? <laughs> what are we, mad? No, we are going kind of mad. We are going a little mad here. Um, that freaking Cephalid uh, Empress might be a few bucks. Wow, oh, she's like 10 bucks. I mean, it's got a really neat ability. Very narrow ability, but a neat ability. Okay, one, two, oh, buckle my shoe. We pulled him twice now. This is the second time we pulled Baron of Bats. We got the Baron Batmaster. <laughs> Howpack Piper. Hey, I can't. you cannot complain about those pools, huh? Not a complaint there. Got ourselves a freaking big old mytho. Are we making a mythic pile? Do we have a mythic pile going here, guys? We have not pulled a mythic yet besides uh, Baron of Bats. Okay. We already know what we got on the backside. Okay, let's get some of that value. Trigger, 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 trigger. This is just, this is madness. This is madness. Dorothea. This is just, it's, 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 it's crazy that it's actually happening. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Look at this. Look at all that. Treacherous werewolf. Just sometimes you just got to look at it and that's all you can do. You know? Okay. Am I right? Yeah. All right, guys. Oh, man. In words of Chevy Chase, this is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy. Here we go. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm going to guess we're going to get a showcase. And I was right. Okay. Another showcase. This is really going to mess up. <clears throat> this is going to mess up value. Um, or I mean, you would think it would. It would screw up something. Oh, why would they put this in here? Come on. It's like, really? No one wants that. Come on, stop it. Wizards. Come on. Give us better list cards. They should really up the ante on the list cards. Like, don't put a list card valued under a dollar in the list cards. In the list card slot. They should really up that. You know, none of this bulky... Tom, like, I've been printed into oblivion crap. You know, make it something special. Uh, there's Unholy uh, Efficient. And we have ourselves some bulkage. Okay. For our list pool. That we just don't want to see. All right. Right now, this is not... Uh, this is a good box. I'll say that. Because we got all these showcases. But I haven't really pulled much uh, Mythic flavor. So let me show you guys a Mythic pool. All right. This is going to be a big one. It's going to be sick. Hendrika Damnasi. How does he know he's going to pull a Mythic? Because, Billy, it's what I do. It's my job. Cruel Witness. And that's it. Okay. We need to do better than uh, Henrika. Even though I don't think we're going to. But, man, Henrika is like a dime a dozen. We've pulled about, I think, 10 Henrikas already. Isn't that insane? No, more than that. I think we pulled more than 10 Henrikas. There's another Edgar. We've, we've pulled about 40 Edgars, or 30 at least. At least 30 Edgars. There's our uh, training drone. There you go. Yeah, it's uh, it's been a real hoot. It's been a real freaking hooter up in here. Here we go, baby. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. I'm going to show you some more value. Skadoosh, Faithbound Judge. Hey, you're a sight for sore eyes. Haven't seen something your way in a while, huh? Okay. Bing, bing. Still cracking. I swear, like, I, right now I'm standing bent over and my back is like, stop hurting me, Joey. Stop that. Joey, stop the hits. Stop the hits. Okay, here we go. Another one, Katilda. I want to see that foil mythic. One of these days, huh? Okay, nothing special that one. That one, uh, that one was not too crazy. It was not too crazy. I think maybe that one box we opened was the freaking huge, the huge dog. There's Giraffe, uh, Giraffe Visionary Stitcher yet again. Been pulling you a lot lately, pal. Edgar, back to back. Uh, Geist, back to back uh, showcase. Guys, life is a trip, man. Look at this. Look at her. We pulled that. That's probably worth a few pennies. It's not bad. You just don't get excited when you see those, you know? Like, who's out? Who's in the market buying that? Who the hell is in the market buying the gold signature artist cards? This is no offense to the artist. This is an offense to, to Wizards of the Coast. <laughs> because, man, and I know they're going to do it. Get artists to sign 100 cards. Distribute those out in packs. Don't do this dumb shit, okay? No, that's not worth anything. The only thing that's worth something, I think like there was a few error ones or something, and people are speculating it's going to be worth something because there's not many of them. <laughs> Scarcity is everything, okay? That's true. But if you're going to do something, dude, do it freaking right, man. Do it right. Give us some real signatures. Give us a real artist. Jacoby, welcome. Give us some real artist signatures. Serial number that sucker to 100. Do it for every artist that uh, was up in... Uh, do it for every single artist that participated. Uh, and and well, who did any art for the set. I don't know how many that would consist of. Maybe 50? 50 or so artists? Maybe more? I'm not sure how it works. I'm not sure how many artists partake on any given set. I never looked into that. It's a detail I don't think many of us ever pay attention to. i got to be honest, you know. Uh, <clears throat> so let's say there's 50. Cool. Send them out a freaking sheet. Or send them out the cards in the mail. It's so easy to do. You know? Pay them something. Include it in a contract or whatever. Whatever you gotta do, Watsy. It's not, it's not math. It's not, it's not science, man. Okay? It's not hard rocket science. Hard rocket science. <laughs> Alright? You send it out in the mail to them. Okay? Come in a little pack. To look like this. 
okay? But there's a hundred of them, like a commander deck size. Have them sign every freaking one of them. Every single one. Sign, 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 signature. Okay? Send it back to Wizards of the Coast. Watsy distributes it. Done. Okay? That's, that's how it should be done. They should be doing this. They need to start implementing that real freaking soon. Hello, double showcase with Flame Breather. And we got ourselves a Noxious Revival. Pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah, that Phyrexian mana stuff was crazy busted, huh? Paying two life. Do whatever you want. <laughs> pretty neat. There we go. Bam, Voldaren. Okay. Foil. The hell is that? I swear it was like a, there was like something in my house. Something creeping around, man. I'm looking at this dude's armor. It looks pretty cool. It's like certain things pop on it. But uh the hell is that? Hello? And it's funny because when I was sitting, uh, I was eating a peanut butter and jelly sandwich with some chips. I was sitting at the table upstairs, kitchen table, and uh, I swear there was someone standing right behind me. I, I could see the shadow of it, and then the shadow disappeared when I turned, you know, to look. No one caught it like my peripheral, and it was gone. Um, but now, now I'm like hearing some things and some doors. I, like that, That's what caught my attention. I heard a door open, but there's no one over there. Okay. And this house is known to be haunted, but uh, my my uh, my uncle Larry recently passed away, and uh, I I was really close to him, so I'm just wondering, you know, <laughs> don't get your hopes up, Joey. Uh, I would love to have him come visit me. Oh man, uh, gutter skulker and biomass mutation. Cool to see a rare in that slot, but just not really worth anything. Um, what we talking about? Uh, before the the ghost spooked us, um, we were speaking about. We should talk about ghosts, man. Ghosts are freaking nutty. You ever have a ghost encounter? Like, real talk, guys? There's Runo. He looks like a ghost. Um, have you ever had a spiritual encounter before? Do you? Here's another question. Do you? How many, how many of you out there even believe in ghosts? Or like an apparition, you know? How many of, I'm going to wonder how many actual believers are out there of this. I strongly, firmly believe. I've, I've seen them. I felt them. <laughs> um, I'm not going to get into details. When I tell the story, people think I'm freaking crazy. And there's not just one story. There's like about six uh, encounters I've had with spirits. And that's a lot. So I know you guys already think I'm nuts. Probably because I am. Okay. But like for real. Dude. That, that ghosts are a thing. <laughs> They are a thing. Mirage, Henrika, because she doesn't ever go away because we like her so much. There we go. The Mythic. And a foil there. We did pull a Death Cap Glade. Uh, we got the Death Clap from that girl. Uh, I know. Should have been a Witter. That was my bad. Uh, all right. I don't hear any other commotion. I mean, that, that all kind of died down. Um, yeah, the last time... Actually, there was a few times... Uh, I'll tell you the most recent ones. And these aren't even the most terrifying. This is, like, petty compared to some of the other stuff that's going on in this house. So, I'm upstairs in my room. I have Jackson with me. <laughs> I'm up in my bedroom. I got Jax with me. And, and he looks over, terrified. Like, I mean, he was, actually, he was, like, one years old. Just started screaming, crying, yelling at the top of his lungs, looking to the hallway. I look over to the hallway, and for at least a solid second, at least a solid second, I saw a dark shadow figure standing in the freaking hallway. And then it disappeared. But, like, I, like, was looking right at it. Like, it wasn't like it was in my imagination, it was standing right there. This thing was big too. Like it was like six foot six. I'm six one. This thing was big. It was intimidating. <laughs> but I mean, it went away, you know? And it wasn't like it was a crazy dark mass, you know? 
but it was it was definitely dark. It was like a shadow on the wall, basically, you know, with a decent with like a, a decent amount of light. That's that's what it was like. Friggin' nutty times, dude. <laughs> nutty freaking times. Unbelievable. Um, yeah, that that was just the most recent experience. And then the time before that, um, I was down here recording. And as I'm recording, I hear uh I hear scr scratching, dragging across the wall. No one's home, by the way, when that happened. It was like this. Like that. And, I, and I'm doing a freaking live stream at the time. I was on Twitch. So this is like two years ago. And I'm like, guys, what the hell? Hold on. <laughs> and I'm pretty certain the Twitch stream caught it. Yeah, I think I played it back. It was on there. No one's home, dude. No one was freaking home. Just bonkers, man. Jacob again showing up. Unbelievable. Jacoby, welcome back, buddy. I mean, that's some terrifying stuff. You know, but like, I, I, I kind of become like used to it. So it's not as spooky as it once was. Or like, it doesn't creep me out as much as it used to. I can tell you another like five, actually yeah, another five or six stories. Um, and that's the terrifying shit from back in the day. But it looks like our videos come to an end here. If you want to hear those stories in the next video, just let me know, you know, drop it in the comments or something. But I want to hear any experiences you guys had, but yeah, uh, that's the whole kit and caboodle. We do have one of these. Let's get that box topper, box topper to cracking. I really don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I, don't, I just don't want to damage a freaking car, but they make it so easy, dude. Okay, let's see what we got. Yep, little fuzz down there. Here we go. Shink. Search for the Count's Castle. Yeah. Okay. That's it. That was another freaking showcase box, guys. Appreciate you tuning in. Drop that like and, uh, yeah, leave me a comment. T talk to me, man. Tell me something about what's going on uh, with anything. If you saw spirits or anything going on, I don't care. You could talk about this panic button for all I care. I appreciate you guys. Joey Moss, Bad Boy MTG. Get out of here, skadoosh.